Over 359 years ago, on May 11, 1665, Greenwich was chartered to be its own separate and distinct town by the General Court of the Colony of Connecticut. At that time, in 17th century New England, a town had to be chartered with an existing church. And the only recognized churches were congregational. Hence, the first Church of Christ in Greenwich also became recognized on May 11, 1665. We now know this church as the first congregational church of Greenwich, which is located across from Binney Park, in Old Greenwich. There were four wooden structures that were built to house religious services beginning with this charter in 1665. The fifth and final meeting house built of stone in 1895 is the one currently in use. Looking at the church's bell tower, the chimes were made in 1930. Note that there are 12 bells in the chimes, which is two more than typical. These two extra bells add greatly to the variety of music that can be rendered. The bells are mounted on a steel framework and weigh between 250 and 2,000 pounds each. <clears throat> the art of stained glass is a handicraft perfected more than 800 years ago in France and England with the pieces of colored glass held together by strips of grooved lead called caning. The first congregational church has a myriad of stained glass windows, which all tell their own story. The north transept windows were designed by the J&R Lamb Studios in a Tiffany style in Greenwich Village, New York in 1896, when the stone meeting house was built. When the meeting house was doubled in size from 1961 to 1963, the Willett Studios in Philadelphia designed the remaining windows. The First Congregational Church is proud to be the founding church for the town of Greenwich, and its open and affirming congregation honors the past, celebrates the present, and leans forward into the future.